Hi guys, it's Andrew of AKS. We're here with your monthly market update uh, for D23. As we always do, we're looking at month just gone, so September 2020, and comparing that with uh, how things were in 2019 across the four key metrics, to kind of give you a bit of a snapshot of what's really happening in the market. Uh, in terms of numbers of new properties that come on, massive increase, 58% more property looking to sell. That's obviously connected to the stamp duty holiday where we've got a window here. If you're going to move in the next few years, you can do it now far cheaper than what you'll be able to next year. So that's driving a lot of people to look to consider their options in terms of moving. The good news is it also means more people are buying. Uh, so we've got a big increase in terms of sales as well with 36% more, uh, more sales being agreed within the month. Uh, numbers of available properties, well yeah, when lots of properties are selling, there's going to be less available uh, and I think you've got a few people that have come off the market as well. So that's a, a relatively steep drop at 10% less available properties. Obviously that all helps to fuel um, those properties that are on the market in terms of finding buyers because there's a lack of competition from, from elsewhere. Uh, and somewhat surprisingly, price reductions have increased as well. So we had 8% more people reducing the price. My thoughts on that, I mean, because typically you wouldn't see price reduction is increasing in a good market, but I think what you've got is motivated sellers. So people that are on the market at the moment, you know, with everything that's going on, if you're gonna have people coming in and out of your house and you're looking to move, you're probably doing that because you're serious about selling. And what you've got is a deadline there where if we get a sale agreed and, you, and a purchase agreed and you're doing it before the end of March, you're not paying the stamp duty. So those that are on the market aren't really testing the market, they're looking to sell. So if they're not getting the interest they want, they're making an adjustment to, to ensure that they do. And I think that's why, even though the market's really healthy, you are still seeing price reductions increasing. It's simply because look, people aren't testing the market, they're looking to move and sell. Thanks so much for watching. As always, if you've got any specific questions around your own property we can help you with answering, please just fire a message across to us. And uh, yeah, enjoy your day.